the 88 Gaming Realm. This is PC Minecraft on a Monday. So uh, that's the spawn town just over there, from what I saw, in the, what I showed you in the last videos. And we're going to go check out Paul 72 stuff. Um, this is his kind of. I t it just makes you think of like a James Bond villain base or something. It's going to be an Iron Golem guard ambling about, making sure no ruffians get in. Let's go see what's under there. Do, 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 do. Garden. Ingenious! It'll catch on. It'll catch on. I like the fountain as well, to be fair. So let's go have a little look. I'm going to have the stairs and through the walkway. Now, Paul's currently playing on creative, but like I said before, entirely up to you guys as to how you want to do it. If you want to play on creative, then uh, just ask and we can set you to creative and then uh, you can uh, build however you like. If you want to do survival and you want to do a bit of a survival game, then go for it. Uh, it's entirely your choice. I really don't mind. So, uh, underground garden. Yeah. Sexy. Let's go. Let's go check out his main base. I always have some coordinates for something to go and check out as well that he's built, but um, we'll go do that in a second. So he's got a lot of stables in here. He's got his diamond horse. His iron horse. Got a lot of stables. You can ride out like the riders of Rohan if need be across that bridge. check that out another time. For now, let's go look at this stuff. Okay. A labyrinth staircase. Very good. Oh, that's quite cool. I like that. A little balcony. Little bench there. Look out over the town. See what people are up to. We'll go check out what that is soon at some point. That's what that is. Some kind of tree base thing. A little balcony on the side here as well. Very good. Carry on up into the main base itself. Choices, choices. Very nice. We've got some farms up here. We've got some sky farms going on. There we go. Carrots and wheat. Staple diet of anybody anywhere in the world. Uh, just go over and swim. Trick here is trying not to miss anything. I'm sure I'm going to get told that I've missed stuff later on. Once the videos go up and go live, I'll be like, Oh, you missed this thing I did. So we've got a wall of furnaces. Should we see if he's got a secret door? Oh, he does have a secret door. Very good. Good man. I like that. I like that. Uh, okay. Onwards. What's over here? So that's his carrot and wheat. This is chest room. Very good. I wonder if there are all these full stuff? Oh, no, oh, okay. I don't know if there's anything in those. Anything in these ones? Woo! Been busy collecting stuff. Okay, so. Let's go have a look at some other stuff. What's through there? Bedrooms. We'll go to the boudoir soon. Full 72. Don't you worry about that. Oh no. Not sure it came from. Very good. Build himself some books. Build some books. Yes. That works. And... Okay. Okay. So we've got a little room with a chest. Doesn't really seem like a bedroom to me, but okay. That's fine. And yeah, just a little room. Fair enough. And let's go around that balcony bit that I just saw there. Let's see what we can find. Sprint, you fool. What is this? Just a, just a little outdoors patio. Good. A bit dangerous, but okay, that's fine. I'm fairly sure there are some. Yeah, there's definitely some like stone bricks down there as well. Oh, Fair enough. Right. Okay. Let's go and check out his wardrobe temple. A lot of stuff. There we go, cool. Let's go down the bottom first off, let it load up. Jump down. <laughs> Failure. Let's go all the way down. Oh no, actually, maybe we should go all the way to the top, because to go down is uh, how you get out. 
So, another big staircase all the way up, and there we go. Master bedroom, look at that. Nice four poster bed there. I like that. That's pretty sweet. I'm going to go check that out in a second as well. We got his alchemy lab for brewing his potions. And then a little library there, very good. And we're going to go down the stairs again, go back the way we came. Here we go. So I'm wondering as to whether the uh, little kind of little James Bond base, as to whether that was just something to kind of a start a thing, and then from there he is now just he's gone buck wild and built exactly whatever the hell he wants. This is very cool though, with the different chests. You have a chest for each thing. That's pretty sweet. I'd assume there's some kind of organization going on here as to what you know, it looks like. Or maybe I don't know. We'll ignore, we're, I'm not going to get into uh, the organisation of it and as to how he's uh, arranging his stuff, but um, it looks as if there is definitely something going on with that. It's a very organised man, I like that. We've got a floor designed for uh, walking around, which is good. You know, no obstacles, you can literally just have a little bit of a, you know, a little bit of a you know, little run around, see? No. Nice sea view there. Okay, and down here we have more farms, more carrots, and more wheat, got some some nice melons. Nice melons there. Uh, oh yes, and this. This is very cool. This is um, a mob spawner. There you go, see? See there? And the mobs just drop down, as with a normal mob spawner. However, they land in hoppers, and then the hoppers then go into the chests. There you go, like that. See? Ta -da -da -da, very good. So, dude's got, dude's, got his, uh, dude's got his plan sorted out. He knows what he's doing. Oh, hello. Oh, many monsters falling to their dooms. Okay, so uh, again, I'm not going to go check out any mines or anything like that because I will get lost for hours and hours. So we'll come up here, and wow, even since like the half an hour ago that I came on and, and saw all this madness, there has been more improvements to this already. That leads back to the town. This will take us over here. Da -da 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 -da. I like this like nether portal gateway thing. I'm not sure if I'm going to get stuck through that, so I'm going to basically go over. Um, and yeah, it's uh, this is Paul 72's Water Temple. My god, is it gorgeous. Look at it. Now, this guy does seem to have some kind of innate talent for building, so I can guarantee you if I record another video in sort of an hour or two hours, there would be even more stuff to show off. But uh, in the meantime, that's it. That is Paul 72's work there.